Hello guys and welcome back to Mortal Kombat 1 and today we're going to be doing the Chaos Reigns um, expansion pack uh, which is the DLC um, story add-on kind of like what they did to Mortal Kombat 11 when they did Aftermath this is same principle um, so the story to this as far as I'm aware is we're going to be fighting Titan Havoc as you know if you watch me play through the main story of this game there was a post credit scene where Titan Havoc um, said he was going to come with an army and, you know, take down Liu Kang. So let's have a look at where this goes. And if you're watching me and you discovered me from the Lego stuff and you think this is going to be similar, do not watch this. This game is not suitable for younger audiences at all. Um, I mean, I was playing Mortal Kombat when I was 10, but that's not that doesn't mean I do not warn you. Because this is one of the most violent, gory, and graphic games on the market. So with that being said, let's just get into Chaos Range. You've been warned now. I'm going to do chapter 16. How many chapters are there? 17, 18, 19, 20. Okay, so we're going to go into chapter 16 here. Moment of Truth, Act 5. Let's have a look. Neverrealm Studios. Cloaked warrior? Is that reptile? There goes Cyrax. What do you guys feel, by the way, about Cyrax and Sector being gender swapped? As long as they still have the personality of the original two, I'm not really too bothered. Whoa, that's cool. The Tyrax always do that. I thought you never miss. Oh, for that armor, I wouldn't have. Stand and fight. You want to fight? Show yourself. And lose the advantage? Have I taught you nothing, Cyrax? <laughs> Can't you just climb back out of there again? Oh shit. Nice. Oh, never no mind. If you had kept your head, been more disciplined, you'd have felt the noose tightening around your neck. I seen your full unseen attacking from a distance. There are rules. Rules? Ling Quay don't fight in tournaments. We fight war! If I am hidden, you must reveal me. That should be second nature to someone with your pedigree. I was wrong, thinking you worthy of that armor. Are we in the dead forest here? We are. Weird that the Lin Kuei will be training in Outworld, but then again, Liu Kang will be hunting them in Earthrealm, won't they? So, I guess it kind of makes sense that they're in Outworld. Right, let's go. Oh, she doesn't have the net? Seriously? Is that the equivalent? Capture foam. Oh, I'm gonna miss the net. Oh, well. Oh, get flawless, bitch. I have um, done the character endings for Sector, Noob Cybot, and Cyrax already. Um, if you're interested in seeing those, go into the TikTok page. They will be up shortly uh, after I've recorded this. Oh, come on. There you go. I win. Let's go. I not shown myself, you never would have found me. You don't like my combat? Send me back to the air mountains. 
You do not go home until I have made you the perfect Lin Kuei. I made your parents that promise, and I will keep it. Oh. Oh, it, oh, it was the danger room. All sub zeros here. Be harm. You outdo yourself. This facility, the armor, even your father's dreams weren't so grand. Only you could have replaced him as our master armorer. Ah, uh, that would have been the Sector in his um, character ending. You are fortunate Sector is your mentor. None is intended, Grandmaster. With your permission, I will begin the armor's mass production. First, it must be tested in battle. We have found Kuai Liang and his Shirai Ryu. They gather at the Wuxi for his wedding. Attack his wedding? I am aware what he's done, but... Surprise will give us the tactical advantage. We may win the battle, but find we lose the war. No one will respect us. Better to be feared than respected. <sighs> I still cannot believe that Liu Kang capitulated to Outworld. That he agreed to break up our clan. He was spineless. As was Kuai Liang for abiding his surrender. They gave up on the Lin Kuei, but we will not. They didn't give up on the Lin Kuei, Bihan. They gave up on you. Get it right, mate. They gave up on you. Don't twist it now. They gave up on you. That's what happened. Smoke and Scorpion gave up on you. Eventually, she will learn the truth about Kuai Liang. We will be ready when she does. Oh, is this the wedding? It's happening at the Wuxi um, Academy. It's Raiden, the pastor. <laughs> That's cool. Today we gather to witness the union of Harumi and Kuai Liang. Let us celebrate their bond as they celebrate each other. As they celebrate e Stage fright, Thunderlad. I have never performed a marriage, and I wasn't Johnny and Kenshi. But and Kung Lao. And Giris were called to Outworld unexpectedly, and I... Relax, Ray dude. You're being very undued. We are just extras in this picture. Kwai Liang and Harumi, they're the stars. There they are. Wonder who else is here. Oh, there's smoke. Uh, smoke must be um, Scorpion's best man, I'm guessing. Man, this reminds me of when Chris and I got hitched. In Hollywood? I bet that was epic. Nah, it was before I got famous. Small service, modest church. Ah, oh, simpler times. Wow, a humble Johnny Cage. As if no one's noticed them yet. I mean, they're bright red and bright yellow. They're not exactly hidden. Gather to witness the union of Harumi and Kuai Liang. Let us celebrate their bond as they celebrate each other. By the Elder Cut. I mean, it's very brave to attack a Shaolin um, wedding when. Oh Jesus! When the Kwa when the Shira Ryu and the Shaolin monks are here.
I wonder if Takeda's here. You got herself, mate. God, please let her have a sister. She does. What in the actual <laughs> They're still not letting Johnny swear. I love it. <laughs> Happened. It's not what happened. Sorry, Smoke, mate. You're getting the fucking work done on you. I don't like this. They're playing with my emotions again, like they're playing with, um, like they did in Aftermath, where they made me play Sindel and Shao Kahn. Where if it was, because right now I really want Smoke and Johnny to win this fight, but yeah. <laughs> you overshot that one a bit, Smoke. Dead. I am an Enra. Kwai Liang has led you astray. No, that is not our mission. That's a Cyrax I know. So it does still have the Cyrax personality. Which I like. Desist. It is not your fight. You defend her, Cyrax? Kwai Liang, Thomas. They've broken their oath. They are fair game. But she is not Lin Kuei. She only attacks because we do. You exactly. Me for honor amidst this brazen assault. It disgusts me. You've corrupted the Lin Kuei. Fight. Exactly, see? Like I said. Like I said. You didn't betray... Scorpion and Smoke didn't betray you. You betrayed them. But it's alright, Cyrax, because you've got Bihan whispering in your ears. So it's fine. I know you don't know. If you knew the truth, you, you'd be with Smoke and Scorpion. Because you seem to be the Cyrax I remember, just not in appearance. I do miss the net, though. I'm going to be honest. <laughs> Look at the bombs, though. How do I do it again? No, uh, is that Sub Zero? Yep. You're either gonna kill your own brother. Then again, you did kill your own father. Brother, to reap the reward of your faithlessness. Ah, uh, Cyrax, take him. 
Yes, Grandmaster. Stand aside. I told you this isn't your fight. You want him? Don't kill Harumi. You're gonna open a can of worms if you kill Harumi. Grant her wish. You know Bihan is wrong, that he acts without honor. No, it is Kwai Liang who's betrayed the Lin Kuei. Uh, uh, that is a lie spoken by the man who let my father perish. What? So impatient to lead. To make the Lin Kuei his, my brother went even further. He broke his sacred oath and sided with outsiders against Earthrealm. No, that, that is impossible. Did I have this when last we saw each other? Who do you think is responsible? Grandmaster, is this true? Every word. Yeah, Bihan would never you lie. Knew That's. This, didn't you? Yeah, she did. I share his vision for the Lin Kuei. We won't be bound by Liu Kang's limits. Breaking our traditions, our vows, I won't stand for it. Which is why we kept you from the truth. Now that you know, you are a threat to the Lin Kuei, and you must be imprisoned. I wonder how much more Lin Kuei would follow if they knew the what? truth, though. You know what I mean? Because Frost has to be around somewhere in the Lin Kuei, do you know what I mean? As well as, um, what's his name? Argus. Not Argus. Argus is the god of Adenia. What's his name? Tundra. There you go. I know Tundra was, um,. Sub was Kwai Liang before he became Sub-Zero in the original timeline. But from what I've noticed is a lot of the names haven't disappeared. They've just changed and altered. There you go. How was I fooled by your lies? An excellent question, Cyrex. Kwai Liang, I have no words. In my heart, I doubted this mission, but in the rush to prove myself, I... That's no excuse. No, it is not. There can only be one punishment. He won't. What you need to remember is, it's Kwai Liang, not Hanzo Hasashi. Hanzo Hasashi would have done, Kwai Liang won't. She was deceived. Give her mercy. Your gift to me on our wedding day. I mean, she did save Harumi as well. As you wish. But no, you are not forgiven. This day has seen too much Shirairayu blood. Raiden and Kenshi. Clay retreat. We've turned them away. Thank you, Raiden. And also to the Shaolin. I am sorry to have entangled you in my family squabble. Detain Bihan and Sector. We will deal with them upon our return to the compound. Respectfully, no. Their crimes are not only against you, but against Earthrealm and Outworld. Their fate lies in the hands of Lord Liu Kang and Empress Melina. Okay, that, that's fair. Are, their lives? Are you mad? I agree. They must answer for aiding Shao's rebellion. And of course, I leave their punishment to you. But killing them will neither restore Sindel nor ease your loss. He's right. <laughs> but it will give me great pleasure. Maybe, but is please, it worth it? Please. When Xiao's rebellion ended and he was imprisoned, my advisors also urged mercy to smother the seditious fire he'd lit. But it stayed. C 
smoldering among his followers. And when Xiao escaped from his cell, it reignited. Now, my sister's armies are stretched to their limits. And as always, Earthrealm's might is at your disposal to help deal with Xiao's threat. What I ask in return is that together we try to break the cycle of violence as partners in peace. What's this? Chameleon's here as well, looks quite cool. I wonder if she actually has voice lines this time around. Who's this? Oh, it's Titan Havoc, is it? And his lot. The Revenants. They're, they're Revenants, aren't they? Yet another timeline. Yes. But whose? Whose head's that? Havocs. Who's that? Luke Kang. Lord Luke Kang. Spare me the theatrics, Havoc. Explain. I fought against you at the pyramid, alongside Titan Shang Tsung. He came to my timeline and sought my aid. Until then, I'd no inkling other timelines existed, let alone that they could be made to fight. That is why you are here. To pit my timeline against yours in combat. Yours. Mine. All timelines. You cannot imagine the chaos. Can I presume the next death you seek is mine? That comes later. <sighs> For now. Good luck. I only need him. Gear us. Why do you need Gear us? Oh, that's Takeda, isn't it? Takeda and Kenshi. Sector and Sub Zero joining us. Yep, cool. Is that? Better to let real warriors handle this. They've got their own Gearus, though. Why do they need our Gearus? You know, go on, chameleon. You and Sub Zero won't earn the Empress's mercy. What said? Her mind doesn't change. We are not fighting for her mercy. We are fighting for our lives. Fight. Chaos Shang Tsung, that's what that is. Chaos Quan Chi, Chaos Shang Tsung. Cool. Locked it. So much for chaos magic. Chameleon is my favorite cameo as well in this game. Little side note. She's the one I use the most.
There you go. You have no business here. Got two pallets there and a sex and a Quan Chi skin. There's Natara. Aha. Uh -huh. My sister. That would be foolish and unnecessary. How's that for foolish and unnecessary? <laughs> Quan Chi, but I mean, I'll take it. I like how, regardless of what skin um, Shang Tsung has on, old Shang Tsung still looks the same, <laughs> regardless. It's it just still makes me laugh. I like using the fatal blows, these two, don't they? It's a shame they don't land. Woo! Hell yeah. There you go. Now have you had enough? Two pallets and a Shang Tsung claw. Oh, a good fighter. It is not just you and Gotti who train from birth. My parents raised me to be Lin Kuei. My skills are their legacy. One gear us fight back. You're stronger than that. She's near that as a maze. <laughs> I agree with Chameleon. Its intended purpose, it now serves Lord Havix. You will fight and die for his amusement. Rejoice. Embrace the chaos. Fight. Ah. So there's four chapters in this game. So I wonder who the third character is going to be. I wonder if that's going to be Takeda. Or one of the other DLC characters we got um, from Mortal Kombat. If anything, it's going to be Takeda because he makes the most sense. Yeah. Chaos, I will Quite good as Sector, actually. I'm just, I prefer Cyrax. <laughs> Oh yeah. I loathe chaos. He is ours, Lord Havoc. Oh, Gearus, what are you doing? Not 
cannot escape. We already have. Oh no. Oh no. What's gonna happen there? What did he want gear us for? I feel like this was part of his plan. Holy shit. I hope you are fond of chaos. Tanya, detain her. Empress, perhaps she has earned mercy. She aided us in combat. Only because we faced a common foe. She was complicit in Mother's death. She deserves no mercy. She may not, Empress. But we will need her aid in the current crisis. We shall take the time to discuss. As you wish. Cater and Kenji, but I don't know why they're. It's Chapter 3 Sub Zero? Oh, there's other Gearuses. They're killing Gearuses. But you can't kill Gearus. He's. It's impossible. But you can't kill Gearus, I don't get it. He is a gifted fighter. He will do well in the arena. No, for him, I have other plans. To pass the time while I infuse my Kamidogu with Gearus' time crystal. What are Kamidogu? Mm, you don't oh, know. no. I know what Kamidogu are. I know what they are. They are powerful ancient relics. When used together, they can remake this timeline's reality. My genius was discerning that they could also shape the reality of other timelines. Pretty much the Infinity Stones of the Mortal Kombat universe, if you guys didn't know. With their time crystals. <laughs> ah, he has brains to go with his brawn. Shouldn't you have captured Liu Kang? Why capture Gyrus? Because he is the only being who has lived in all prior timelines. Which means the time crystals within him contain the building blocks of all current timelines. Once my Kamidogu are infused with them, I will have the power to remake all timelines as I see fit. Condemning us all to anarchy. Not condemned. Elevated. Perfected. Uh, as you will be. Once I'm finished. Shit. This new havoc is different from ours. The one who helped Xiao's rebellion. He doesn't want freedom. He wants to burn everything down. Smashing timelines together so he can watch them fight? Our yeah, that's what he wants to do. It's havoc. Because I recrafted his destiny when I restarted time. Meeting Titan Havoc proves it was wise I did. First that Shang Tsung, now this Havoc? 
Will the threats from these titans never cease? Tell me, how do we escape this crisis? We must rescue Gears before Havoc takes from him what he needs. I will dispatch several legions. Katana Your Majesty, they are needed here. Shao's escape, his renewed rebellion leave Outworld vulnerable. Similarly, I cannot go, as my absence would leave the timeline vulnerable. Which is why so who do we send? We need Sector. As Lin Kuei, she and Cyrax are trained for this type of mission, and they have the benefit of being with us here. I can send them immediately, under Scorpion's command. I want neither's help. I will go alone. That would be unwise. Do not it would doubt be Scorpion. Cyrax's need to make amends. And do not doubt Sector's hatred of Havoc's chaos. Or her longing for Sub-Zero's safe return. Neither will betray us. Trust Sector. Are you sure? No. I am also not sure I trust you. That's fair. But Liu Kang is right. We must act. You understand the terms of your release? Retrieving Geras is our priority. Rescuing Bihan is secondary. We save him only if the mission is not put at risk. That was made clear. Do not forget. Move. Liu Kang is waiting. What the hell's this? I have never seen the like. Nor have I. No distractions. Either of you. He scolds me like some new initiate? Calm yourself. You are. We cannot save our timeline if we fight among ourselves. When this crisis ends, we settle our differences. I want to be honest, it wasn't really a scolding. The show Khan. Lots of show Khan. Weird slug. Or oh, snail, sorry. It is madness. We must find Giras in this. Don't think you'll have to look far. Who's this fella? Don't tell me it's Johnny Cage. It is. Johnny Cage. Is he filming a version of Captain America? <laughs> oh, it's Reptile. And Ermac, too. Beating your gums. 
He's getting uh, nothing from me. Once Baraka. The cryo monster. You will be next. Name: Jonathan Cage. Rank: Lieutenant Colonel. Serial number: Piss off. Lieutenant Colonel Cage. I wonder if that's genuine. So he's not an actor in this timeline. He's a soldier. He knows where to find Gidas. And the cryomancer that Tarkatan mentioned. It must be Bihan. I concur. Unless he's an actor. He's just acting. He's still the same, Johnny. <laughs> Not shot. Ow, 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 ow. In all honesty, because there's only four chapters, I could probably do this whole thing today. <laughs> there we go. Are all foes here so inept? Yes. I like your grit. You've ruined me for the girls back home. Less flirting, more fighting. Uh, Mac. Chaos Ermac, he looks exactly the same as normal Ermac. There's no difference. I do like that skin though for Johnny, it's quite cool. Oh, hello. Is this Outworld? I feel like it is, but it's a different version of Outworld. You know what I mean? If that makes sense. Come on. There we go. Here comes Reptile. Oh shit. This is some bad business. Never seen as a Terran? Is that what the hell he is? Lord Havoc wants you captured. Your choice if it is dead or alive. Fight. Oh, God damn it. Come on. Throw his eyes off, mate. Never impressed me. 
nor me. Well, chameleon reptile, though. Bye bye. Shit. Shit. There you go. I win. I choose to be on my way. Are you hurt? Not a scratch. No, nah, I'm sound. Allow me to salute your tailor. That is a hell of a fine suit. Lieutenant Colonel Jonathan Cage, U.S. Army, 44th Infantry. One moment I was fighting Hitler in France, the next, I was here, fighting some asshole named Havoc. We have a Johnny Cage where we come from, though the two of you have little in common. Six months ago, I'd have been gobsmacked by that. But now, I realize I'm... we're... a dime a dozen. Ah, this mashed up world's things has got my brain foobar. Fuba. Fuck's up beyond all repair. Lieutenant Colonel, what happened? At ease, friends. He's with Is that rain? Thank Argus you are safe. I'd be a gold star in Mama's window if it weren't for these fine people. Emperor, meet Sector, and she ah I'm sorry, I never got your names. Scorpion. This is Cyrex. I am Rain. No need to use my title. Emperor Rain, that's cool. An empire. Havoc has taken it. I assume you're among his latest victims. You do not yet seem the worse for wear. Havoc arrived recently in our timeline, kidnapping a being who is key to his plans to destroy it. We have a nice Rain for a change. I'm so happy about this, by the way. Can I just say? But we've got shit to show for it. Our attack on a citadel was a bust. He said thank Argus as well, which is weird, so that might mean his dad didn't abandon him in this timeline. She is to fight for Havoc's perverse pleasure tomorrow in his arena. To the death. The being Havoc kidnapped. I would think he is at the citadel. It is where Havoc spends his time. Can you get us there? Sure thing. But getting in, finding your friend. It's a whole another kettle of fish. Rain's wife is the only one with a scoop on the Citadel's layout. Okay. Then we must save her before it is too late. Your aid is welcome, but be warned, death is more likely than success. Who is Rain's wife? I might have missed it. He might have said, but I, I missed that. Who is Rain's wife? It's not Lee May, is it? There's Frost. Lee May and um, Quan Chi were fighting there as well. Crowd of Havocs. Holy shit. <laughs> I can't believe what I've just fucking seen. <laughs> to make a wager? The sorcerer, no question. Frost will win. Every variant of her who's ever fought here has been fierce. Ah, I should have kept Kronika alive after taking her hourglass. So I could rub her nose in what I've made of her golden balance. She would disapprove? She would despise it. It was her own fault. She didn't think me a threat. Hulk off. He's got a periscope. <laughs> Reiko and Li Mei, the rulers Tanya and I deposed, also revered blood sports. I had hoped I had seen their end. Who's Tanya, your wife? She just have a thing for emperors and empresses. How long 
did you hold power? Before Havoc came? Long enough to miss what he destroyed. Everything changed in an instant. Our timeline merged into his and was reduced to anarchy. Who was the keeper of time in your timeline? I'm guessing it's you, Ray? Maybe? Or is it Tanya? Emperor Rain. Okay, cool. I can get behind this, actually. I think this would be the first time I've actually played as Rain in a, in a Mortal Kombat story. It was also the first time I played as um, Sector 2. see no she doesn't look like a keeper of time her eyes aren't blue for starters oh it's on you Let's have it going. It seems we have an unexpected, but welcome wrinkle. Tanya will have partners in combat. What's happening? Our oh, rain tried to save them all. This is a new rain, and I like it. <laughs> I've never seen rain actually be nice. It's weird. Without my empress, I am not an emperor. You celebrate too soon. This fight is just beginning. Who are they? They're friends, Tanya. There's havoc. Where's he going? Kenji's blade excels at ferreting out intruders. I was not expecting you three quite so soon. Your Liu Kang was shrewd to take the initiative. Come down here, Havoc. We are waiting. Yes. Entertain your lackeys by fighting us yourself. You would die too quickly. My followers. Deserve so much more. An army of Havocs, though, is quite a thing, right? Havocs are very hard to kill. How do you even kill a Havoc? He's gonna use his head as the. I can't believe this shit. <laughs> this is a fever dream. This feels like the shit I see in my nightmares. I'm gonna be honest. More like night terrors, to be honest. Go on, Hon. I nearly called you Hanzo. Quietly. <laughs> I'm so not used to the fact that Hanzo isn't Scorpion anymore. Yes! He got an F bomb in! Finally! A vampire? A demon? Havoc needs to do better than that. When my Chris fells you, orders collapse will be hastened. With every strike of it, my soul is one step closer to chaos. I'm surprised they didn't use what's his name in this DLC. If you had Havoc as the main villain, why didn't they use is his name Hataru? Hotaro? Or something like that? Um the guy from Order Realm with the flag on his back. You know, why not use Havoc's um 
Nemesis. As well with Darius, why didn't they give Darius a full like character of a moveset and stuff? If Darius is Havoc's best friend, you know what I mean? Someone's over there trying to fight Titan Havoc, that's cool. <laughs> Someone make a note of that man's bravery. No! I nearly flawless! How do I do that move again? I've not played as Rain in a very long time. As long as I live, I will keep anarchy at bay. Very good. They will overwhelm us if we don't escape. That way! Nicely done, Johnny. No, not nicely done. Shao Kahn's here, I think. Sindel. Well done, husband. We have them. They fight like Reiko and Li Mei. We defeated those tyrants. We can defeat these. I have faith in Argus, Delia, and you. <laughs> Fight. Gonna be laughing soon, Sindel. How does that big bastard do a flying kick that quickly? Is the size of him? The waters will sweep you away. It'd make more sense if he threw his hammer, no? There we go. There you go. I win. Tyrants always fall. What's that? I adore your quick thinking. Just one of the many reasons you wed me. Love sick fools. Cast your eyes here, not on each other. To behold those who bring you death. Just saying, uh, the good guys need to start killing more villains off. Because knocking them out only does so much. You know what I mean? Like Mortal Kombat needs to take that into account. The good guys need to start killing more, um, more villains. Neverrealm Studios are trying to sell as well, aren't they? And I think, I think Microsoft approached uh, Neverrealm, didn't they, to purchase? I don't know. Um, Whereabouts that is though with that deal. I don't know whereabouts we're looking at that. Nasty. Death will come no closer. I have a Tanya thing, I should probably use him up. There we go. Ah fuck. Damn it. There you go. I win. Do not be so quick to demand attention. We must get to the tunnel. Yes, expeditiously. All right, come on, guys. Let's go. This will be amusing. 
I'm guessing there's something down here, is there? This is where they've chained up Homelander. <laughs> Like, you can tell which one's a ninja just by how they climbed over that. Come on, Johnny. Johnny's going to be hit by one of these. Oh, he isn't. Come on. Awesome. Oh, bollocks. So much for our escape. <laughs> escape? The tunnel is an entrance, not an exit. Entrance to what? In the maze. Its route is ever changing. Its tracks beyond ingenious. Its denizens. Wickedly lethal. No one survives. I delight in devising new ways to kill. We won't give you the pleasure. We won't die here. <laughs> Death is assured. The only question is how it claims you. Oh. We will weather this storm together. So let's hide! Nice kick, good form, 10 out of 10. Nice kick, good form, 10 out of 10. He's actually picked up a shield now. He's doing the Captain America thing. That didn't go where we wanted it to. <laughs> Come on, Johnny. Nice. That's handy. No, no good. No. It is no use. It's too thick. Well, this is a pretty pickle. Cyrax, we are going to keep moving. With luck, our path will cross somewhere ahead. Understood. The others are moving on. We should too. Agreed. Come. Oh. Um handle the others, please. They don't Emperor look chaos though. Emperor are ours. Oh, is that Empress Reiko and em Emperor Li Mei? Yeah. I am not surprised that you aligned with Havoc. You'll do anything to obtain the power you crave. Do not lecture us. You're no better. That's why you stole our throne. We acted for Outworld, not ourselves. To free it from your corrupt regime. Fight. Yeah, Lee May. Fuck you. <laughs> ah. Ow. Stop it. I hope I'm gonna get some of these skins, man. Some of these skins are really cool. Especially this rain skin. This rain skin's awesome. That Johnny Cage one as well. I want that one. Seriously? There you go. Guys are kick for the win. Guys are kick for the win. Kick him for a portal. Ow. Ow. Yes. Fuck. I'm being distracted by the leg. Ow. 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 Ah! Love it. Don't land. 
fuck it landed. I might die here. Yeah. He's won this fight. Bollocks. Mother. Have it. There we go. I win. You will never regain your power. That sector, we must help. Merciful Delia. <laughs> Chaos manifests in myriad ways. You will fight them again and again until you finish them. Only then may you move on. Fight! Oh, so you have to kill them. Well, you know what you need to do then, don't you, Ray? Come on. Ow. Ow. God damn you. <laughs> 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 I'll not fit all blow work out for. There we go. I win. I take no oh, look at all that stuff I just unlocked. Next. It is their lives or ours. You heard Havoc. But I wish only to take his. You're gonna drown them. His voice. As am I. Let us find Sector. Hopefully, Havoc keeps his word. I don't think he will. <laughs> Thank Argus. The more you die, the more Havoc sends. I'll admit, I relish the challenge. Are you prepared for the next? What no. Now? It is fiendishly simple. To survive, you must open that door. Let me guess, the door's locked. Havoc let us pass so he could crush us. Step back. This is getting us nowhere. The lock can be picked. If there's enough time. And hurry up, man. Get on with it. Every day, 
You remind me why I chose you. You're gonna take this rain off me. You gave me a rain that's actually nice, and now you're gonna kill him. There it is. These corridors go on and on like my old CO. Damn, Major Blake could talk. <laughs> Realize I have not thanked you for sparing me. <laughs> Thank her to me. It was her request. I do not expect forgiveness, but I do expect understanding. The lies told to me. How long have we known each other that you could ever believe I... You vanished without explanation. The Han, my grandmaster, gave me one. It made no sense, but then nothing about your departure did. You blame me for your actions? Is that what you're saying? No, that's not what she's saying, Scorpion. I am saying I am not a machine. I am human, and humans make mistakes. We will finish this later. I might split this into two parts. Have its magic Depending on how long it is. Sensors. They are not detecting the traps. This fiendish place. To think it will be my husband's tomb. At least he died with honor. Giving his life for yours. Please, don't. If I dwell more on it, I will come undone. Speak of anything else. Perhaps your friends. They are allies, not friends. And only for the length of this crisis. When it is over, we will settle our differences in combat. Is your fight over land? Resources? Myself and others seek a powerful future. They and their ilk cling to an anemic past. And that is something worth killing for? No less than the capture of a throne or a realm. Untold died satisfying Reiko and Li Mei's barbaric whims. Ours was not a squabble for visions for the future. <laughs> if this keeps up, they may fight each other. They won't get the chance. Neither will survive the next encounter. What exactly are we waiting for here then? The next encounter? Which one? They could lead anywhere. There's no way to know. Let us choose and keep moving. Is that a dragon? I think it is. Your armor failed to detect that too? It is not programmed for dragons. We can get past, if I can calm her. Calm her? How? By filling her empty belly. Oren is famished. She hasn't fed in days. <gasps> Maze Hunter Melina. That's very Mad Max. And a Maze Hunter Katana too, to go with. I think this um, skin is the one you get for doing the Towers of Time. 
Because I saw that skin and I thought, I've not seen that before. When I was uh, looking at the Towers of Time thing. Damn you. Dragon's name is Orin. Interesting name. There you go. I win. How dare you abuse such a magnificent creature? I would have thought they'd had enough. Plainly, they are gluttons for punishment. They fight to entertain me. They know the Satan's kill. Fine then. This time we will finish them. How will you if you cannot keep your feet? Well, Sector can fly. What the fuck? Like Doctor Strange, this shit. Havoc thought that would kill us? He has no idea what we can do. You are able, not invincible. Have no doubt that you will die here. Fight! Here we go. Woo! I wonder where they're going to go from here with the story of Mortal Kombat. Because I absolutely love the story of Mortal Kombat, I'm going to be honest. There we go. Come on. Stop blocking my shit. There we go. It will not be you who kills me. Shall we? The dragon awaits. Oh yes, I forgot about the dragon. How are you calm, her, Tanya? She must also be a telepath, it would seem. Read their thoughts. This is interesting. There's the dragon. Futara Orin. Ama Tanya. Nijana Eshwa. Rahapu Shapuru. Orin, I beseech you. We mean no harm. You speak dragon tongue. And with the proper respect. Yet. 
She has opened the door. Come. Can she? I do not understand them. The language is foreign. Well, you are a dragon, so... is being held captive. If we free him, we can save their timeline, and Havoc will fall. Show me your destination. I will send you there. What did she say? That she can help. Help? How? Why don't you free her? She's opened a portal. No, this will not do. Don't you make that. Go quickly. Go. Drains my power. Thank you, Oren. I will come back for you after this crisis passes. Wonder if she does. My new minion will have to occupy them until we arrive. Warn him. The Citadel has been infiltrated. New minion. As he changed Sub Zero into something, then. Bender, I don't remember. I feel like I'm heavily sauced. It appears. Infinite. How are we inside a Citadel? Do not try to make sense of it. Anything is possible in Havoc's domain. How do you know the Citadel's secrets? I spent months posing as one of Havoc's minions to gather intelligence for our assault. There, Havoc's foundry. If your friend is here, he is beyond that door. Nope. Well, on a run. Absorbed it all. You saved my life. 
Thank you. I am happy to return the favor. My armor flies short distances. I can retrieve them one at a time. Be careful. Fall off the pathways and you will fall forever. Allow the Brotherhood of Chaos to help you on your way. Oh, it's Noob. He's here. I was waiting for him to show up. Is this R. B. Han or is this? You sound like B. Han. I am he, though not as you remember. What did havoc do to you? He perfected me, baptizing me in chaos. Those who oppose anarchy, who revere order, will be eliminated. For those of you who don't know, the reason Noob Cybot is called Noob Cybot is it's the creator of Mortal Kombat's names backwards, their surnames. So Ed Boon and John Tobias, it's their names backwards put together. Ow, 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 ow. Ow. Aha. Goodbye. Havoc's will will not be done. He's gone. Where is Bihan? You know him from your timeline? Yes. But he has been corrupted. I must restore him. Bring him back. Do not fret. I am sure we haven't seen the last of him. Nice. Do you mind a change of partner? Not at all, Cyrax. Thus far, your brotherhood does not impress. Havig is deluded if he thinks you can contain us. Fight. Maybe it's not to contain. Maybe it's not to contain. Maybe it's something else entirely. There we go, Empress Tanya wins. Come on. Damn you. Ow. Hell yeah. There we go. Finally. Remain unimpressed. Tanya, step aside. Oh, it's Liu Kang. You will be scorched by the flames of anarchy. Well, a fire version of him. Fire, razor edged hats. I've had enough chaos for one day. As have I, Cyrax. As have I. Right, let's do it. Good damn you.
Love it. Let's roll him around. Come on. Ow. I missed that. I didn't miss that. Damn it. And he got me. Bastard. There you go. Hit you back with one, mate. Hit you back with one. How's that for it? is here defending havoc defending him is there no low he won't sink to he is not himself his mind has been broken that may be so but if he gets in our way we have to bring him back so we can undo the evil that's been done to him only if it won't jeopardize the mission you would leave him to die have he left his dad to die he is owed no more respect than he showed my father. There he is. Tire suits you. It is as black as your heart. How oh, are you always so blind? First to the Lin Kuei's potential, now to the perfection of Lord Havoc's chaos. It is your ambition that is blind, Bihan. As always, though he twisted your mind to his purpose, he left your desires unchanged. Uh, am I going to play a scorpion for this fight? Or is it going to give me Tanya again in a minute? Nice. Yeah, it's giving me Tanya again. Don't fucking stand talking about it. Just go help him. Despite what Kwai Liang says, he would regret it if he loses Bihan. We cannot kill him. No promises. Havoc must be stopped, no matter the cost. Oh, because you've killed everybody else so far. You haven't, Tanya. There you go. That's one round done already. Nice one. Fight. Yeah. Uh -huh. Ow. I win. Thankfully, death won't be necessary. 
Arthic has made him odious. This must be undone. The Lin Kuei's Elder Arcanist knows nothing of Havoc's magic. Liu Kang is your only hope. You should not have plotted against him. You refuse to help? He's your brother. Kuai Liang has forgotten how to honor his family. Do not confuse pity for allegiance, Sector. I refuse to take sides. You can't say that when Bihan killed the dad. Havoc wants his time crystals. These relics must be extracting it. <laughs> Perhaps the process must be interrupted. Perfect. You okay, Gyrus? When you are ready, we must leave. And take the Kamidoku as well. Good idea. Very good idea. Who's the wise guy who plastered these on here? Havoc's here. No, Gyrus. We have them. Nice. Nicely done. Right, the tide is turning. Oh, you're about to get this work, Havoc. Oh, you're about to get this work. Let's close that. Only his mind is meant it. Havoc's magic is unlike anything I have encountered. It will not be easily mastered. Bihan, can you hear me? remains its resolution must wait it will be moot if we do not stop havoc on that Liu Kang we agree we have his kamidogu that will slow him down only if we keep them from him we can assume he is already on his way once in the temple of the elements they will be beyond his reach the others wait for you outside they will accompany you on the journey. Now, Bihan, what can you tell me of your captivity? He knows what I know. When my mind was broken, it became an open book. All my knowledge was laid bare for Havoc's inspection. So he is aware of our defenses. And also of the portal gateways at Ying Valley. If he recovers the Kamidoku, he will use them to hasten capture of this timeline by projecting his chaos into all realms at once. I should have been stronger. Of the failings which should shame you, this is not one. 
few could withstand the Titan. Septon, are you with Lucan? Yes. Why do? Come to the entrance. All right, let's go. Big CGI fight coming up. Where's the, where's the chest? Where's the chest? There he is. He's got him. He's got him. Fuck. Raiding my citadel. Stealing my Kamidoku. Ah, your warriors are adept at creating chaos. So good of you to approve. Approve? You dare mm. to throw my plans into disarray? <laughs> the only chaos you revere is yours. You are no zealot. You are a hypocrite. <sighs> the Kamidogu are powered, and I am ready. Nothing can stop me from seizing this timeline. Um, he's called Liu Kang. <laughs> Do something to stop him then, don't just stand there. <laughs> oh man, just let him fucking absorb it all. Dispose of them as you wish. The more painful it is, the better. Right, let's go. We will spill your blood to birth eternal chaos. Be glad your deaths serve such a righteous cause. Fight! Noob, now that you're here, can we please kill these people so they, we don't have to worry about them later on? Just saying, my friend. I need a merciless good guy, man, who just kills these cunts. When it happens. I will not die today. Fight. <laughs> uh, I've missed noob. Bastard. There you go. I went. The blood spilled today will be yours, not mine. You tell them, noob. Dodged it. Dodged it.
I've lot. And he got me. Oh well. Go on, I'll hit you with mine then. Go on. Never mind, no one. Have that. Who's this? I will bury you in a glacier of hail. Stay there. He is mine to finish. more important winning this fight or protecting your ego huh. shall we leave them to their quarrel no let us silence it forever fight all right round two against these two Oh, yeah. Come on. Damn you. There you go. I win. Once again. No reason your life should continue. Wait. No, kill them. There's no wait. Just fucking kill them. Exactly, right? It's Mortal Kombat. Fucking kill them. There you go. That was entirely unhelpful. We could have pressed them for information. I doubt either knew anything. They were underlings. Possibly. But we will never know. We would have been better served had cooler heads prevailed. Either way, our goal is unchanged. Let us rid ourselves of havoc. Agreed. We will gather my champions and depart for Ying Valley. No, I'm still with Biha. Kill them. Oh, yeah, they're going to rebuild Titan Shang Tsung's um, things, aren't they? No, it's not. <laughs> Guess again. Liu Kang and his allies are determined to keep things interesting. Thoughts. 
the more, the merrier. That was too cold, that. I'm gonna be honest. That, well, I just saw Noob doing Gearus was a bit too cold. <laughs> Alright, we're fighting a father and son duo here. Enough toying with them. We've a job to do. Patience, father. You're the one who taught that death should be entertaining. Fight. Shit. Hello. Sorry, Takeda, mate. Oh, yeah. Piss off a minute, Takeda. Let me just. There we are. I win. I am entertained. Are you? I have them. Impressive display. One does not trifle with guards. No, one kills them. Stay back. I will finish this. No, Liu Kang. They are mine. I, I think he's too bloodthirsty, which Liu Kang isn't liking at the moment. I think that's Liu Kang's main problem with Noob at the moment. It's because he's bloodthirsty. Think you're clever. Think you're clever dodging me shit. There you are, have that. How does one do Cybot slide? Tele slam. He does still have it. Awesome. Have that. Oh, that grab's cool. I like that grab. <laughs> oh, I win. Now, only one battle remains. We have him now. Of course. to the void submit to your order and abandon my triumph you've gone mad this timeline will not succumb to chaos its beings are not meant to live that way meant to there are no sacred laws no divine rules Choose what is right, because I hold the power, and I choose to bless all beings everywhere with anarchy.
What the fuck? Do something then, don't just stand there. Also, all right. Have it. He's got more health than me, and he does a lot more damage than me, especially with that fucking chest beam attack. Everything else, though, he seems to just be normal. Everything else seems to just be as normal. Except that. What the fuck? There we are. That's one round one. Well, I need to win one more of them. Oh, that's cool. I like that fatal blow. That's cool. I have to fight him like a bitch. I win. I win. Stick that in your pipe and fucking smoke it, bitch. Taking him to the Shadow Realm, isn't he? He can't reform in the Shadow Realm, I guess. For Bihan, he would have gained nothing from his challenge. Very well. To reward your efforts on our timeline's behalf, I will see that you are spared Empress Melina's wrath. Go, return to the Lin Kuei. And Bihan? He will remain with me until he has been restored. 
I will be kept apprised of his progress. As I see fit. And Sector. Further Lin Kuei transgressions will be severely punished. As their Grand Master in Bi Han's absence, you will be held responsible. Right, what's the plan? Yeah, they put him in that coffin. What's the plan there, though? Can Havoc's magic truly be undone? Yes. Though comprehending its intricacies may take years. For now. Bian will reside at the Temple of the Elements. It is safer for all that way. Is that Sujinko with the bandana? Your decision. I know Harumi's thoughts, but I remain unsure. Trust your wife, Kwai Liang. Avail yourself of her wisdom. Who's this? Johnny, maybe? No, not Johnny. Cyrax. You came. Thank you. I promised a decision, and I have one. Before you share it, may I say one more time that I you fought well against Havoc. You also saved my life. But that is... Not enough. I understand. But that is not all. I had no business judging you for believing Bihan's lies. I too was taken in. It is he and he alone who deserves my ire. You, however, Deserve an invitation. I. I. What can I say? Yes. Thank you, Kuai Liang. Thank you, Grand Master. Awesome. Cool. Right, so there we are. We got the credits again. Which we've, I've seen countless times because of the tower endings and things. <laughs> but, um... So, no, let's see if there's a post credit scene. I'm interested to see if there's a post credit scene. Um, but like I was saying um, earlier on, I'm amazed that they had Titan Havoc as the main villain for this, right? But they didn't have... Is his name Ataru? As the as one of the characters we would play as. Because Ataru is from Order Realm and is Havoc's nemesis. Kinda like Scorpion Sub Zero. Do you know what I mean? So I'm a bit surprised that that isn't exactly how they went with that. I'm still amazed Jade hasn't showed up. Even just in passing, you know, even just in a cutscene. Um, same thing with Kotal, um, well, Kotal, because he won't be a Khan anymore. And several other characters as well. I'm, I know Takeda showed up as a villain, but we know Takeda is in the Shira Ryu, thanks to his um, tower ending. And the tower endings in this game are all canon as well, which is good. Um, who else didn't we see? We didn't see... Uh, what's his name? Either. Who do we... We didn't see any of the villains from 
this in terms of we didn't see Shang Tsung, we didn't see Shao Kahn, we didn't see Quan Chi, but they were mentioned vaguely. And we, I know we saw Chaos versions of them, but we didn't see this timeline's versions of them. So it's interesting to see what they'll be up to and where we're going with the next game. Because um, I can't see them doing another story DLC after this. If they will, I'll be surprised. I'll be pleasantly surprised, but I don't think they'll do one. Uh, so let's just wait and see if there's a post credit scene. I'm. Oh, here we are. No. More. We've got more <laughs> things here. But anyway, uh, what else do we have? Just thinking about other characters as well that would be cool to see in Mortal Kombat 1. Definitely feel like Scarlet will be interesting to see. Um, Aaron Black, um, the Black Dragon, the Special Forces. Seeing Jax um, and Sonya Blade again would be nice because we've not seen any of the Special Forces uh, in this story besides Johnny Cage, if you want to consider him Special Forces, but I don't really consider him Special Forces. Um, there is also, I know we have Jax and Sonya cameos, but that doesn't really count. The only other thing we saw of them is we saw Ken, we saw Jax in Kenshi's ending. I, but we haven't seen Sonya anywhere else as far as I'm aware. And then there's the, obviously the Black Dragon with Kano and Eren Black and Cabal. We've not seen any of those guys. Um, and there's loads more members of the of the Black Dragon, I know. We've seen the Red Dragon be mentioned with Mavado and Dagon turning up in Takeda's Tower Ending. Um, but I think that's really it. But there's just a lot... There is a lot of characters in Mortal Kombat and... I know they're not going to be able to get them all into one game. Um, obviously, you can hope for that. I mean, they did kind of do that in Mortal Kombat Armageddon, but Mortal Kombat Armageddon was not very well received. I remember when that game came out, not many people liked it. Um, not too sure why. <laughs> I, I genuinely don't know why. But I, I enjoyed Armageddon anyway. But I like how many different games they put into Mortal Kombat 1. It's very similar to what they did with Mortal Kombat 9. Because Mortal Kombat 1 has very much been a mix, a mixture of um, Deadly Alliance, Deception and Armageddon. And then with this um, DLC, it's very much been like the comic book that came out to advertise Mortal Kombat X. I f uh, these credits weren't this long, were they, <laughs> last time? Obviously, I, want I need to watch them because I don't want to skip in case there is a post credit scene. I don't actually know how many there is here. I didn't realise they were this long. Spanish. We're on Spanish now. <laughs> on Brazilian Portuguese. To be fair, I probably could skip this and it'd still come up, but I just don't want to risk that. <laughs> I do not want to take that risk. Trying to, on a serious note, though, I'm trying to think: Is there any other characters in Mortal Kombat that should have turned up in this game? Realistically, I can't think of any. The direction they went with Cyrax and Sector as well, where they made them both female. Um, I'm not really against it. I thought I would be, but I'm not because they still have the personalities of the original um, characters. So that's, that's not too bad.
So like, that's, there's not really much else I can say about this, really, is there? I mean, out of all of them, it it was... Was it a better DLC than Aftermath? I feel like it had a better ending. And a better... Like a nicer thing to it. Because Aftermath played with my emotions too much. Um, no, I can't really think of anything really else to say about this DLC. I mean, it was... It was good. I enjoyed... There was a lot of good skins in this DLC that... Looked really cool. You know, like the Johnny Cage skin where he had the army outfit. And I don't know if he was actually in the army. He might have been, but who knows. Or it could have just been an axe he was playing. Then there was the Emperor and Empress um, Rain and Tanya. They were very cool. I enjoyed those skins. I enjoyed seeing a version of Rain where Rain was actually good. In terms of him being a nice person. Because usually Rain is very much selfish and hell-bent on revenge and um, overthrowing his father. But in that, he said thank Argus a lot. So it seems like Argus didn't abandon him as a child this time round, maybe. In that timeline, anyway. But I'm interested to see if they will they go with Rain's story in the main timeline as well. Because obviously he sank some... Um, Sido's capital, Re regretted it, turned himself in, and he was in. He's now in prison in our world. So we'll have to see where that goes. We didn't see many at much of our world, though, did we? I mean, we saw Melina, Tanya, and Chameleon and Katana and things for a second or two in the f the um, first chapter we did, and then after that, we didn't see any of them. Not from our timeline anyway we saw them from the other timelines when they were chaos um, versions of themselves but other than that we didn't see them I don't I t see now these credits are going on very long it's like Assassin's Creed credits <laughs> I was trying to think, actually. I don't really think much else really happened that's worth talking about. Hmm. Well, actually, yeah. So what are they going to do with the villains next time? Who's the villain going to be? Are they going to bring another person from a different timeline who's a Titan version? Are they going to do a Titan Shao Kahn? A version of Shao Kahn and Sindel where they beat um, Shang Tsung in the final battle in Aftermath. And then they beat Liu Kang. Are they going to do that? You know what I mean? Voice talent now. See, this is the last bit. Because like I say, voice actors just get pushed to the side. <laughs> Atom Hawk UK. I've never heard of them. Three D animators, We're still going here, man. I don't know how long these pre these credits are. But there are they are adding three more characters in out of this pack, which are of course the three guest characters. You've got the T one thousand, you've got Conan the Barbarian, and you've got Ghostface. Um, and to be honest, I don't care about either of them. I don't care about any of them. I've not heard about a guest character ever, really. They're just something I just prefer not to see. I'd just rather see Mortal Kombat characters fill those slots. I know some people love the guest characters, and that's fine, but for me, I'd prefer to see 
I mean, there's three slots there that they've used for these guest characters. You know, you could have done, like I said, you could have done Hataro, Jade, you could have done Aaron Black, Sonya, Jax, Cobra, Kano. There's so many people you could have put in those, op in those options, and you didn't. And it's the same argument with the previous um, battle, um, combat pack, where you got Homelander, Peacemaker, and Omni-Man. Again, I don't care for any of them. I'd rather, I'd much rather see those slots be used on Mortal Kombat characters. Hell, I'd even rather see fucking Cobra fill one of those slots. Or even someone like Moloch. Do you know what I mean? Just people who we've not seen in ages fill these slots. Because it, it actually brings so much needed love to Mortal Kombat characters who we've not seen in a while. And give them... A fresh breath of life and give them new story and new whatever to actually make them very uh, to actually make them good characters with good backstory stories and actually make them liked because how many people give a shit about burn face do you know what i mean i said i said the name burn face and you're all like who the fuck is that precisely my point how many people give a shit about draman Again, I said that name and most of you are probably going, who the fuck's Draman? This is what I mean, there's multiple combat characters that exist who are awesome. And they're just not using them. They just keep using the same ones over and over again. The only time they didn't is with this game, when they made the original Lost roster, where they included Lee May, Reiko, Havoc. You know, these are characters we'd not seen in a very long time. And Asher and Natara as well. These are characters we'd not seen since the PS2 games. But they, but they brought them back. But I feel like they need to do this more. Bring back characters we've not seen in a long time. And give them a fresh breath of life. Give them some new direction. Some new storytelling. Some new goals. Like they did with the... Uh, like they did in this game. Where they made Lee May a police officer. And she was... Well, not a police officer. Outworld's version of a police officer. And she let Jared down. And Jared died and all that stuff. You know... Gives these characters who we've not seen in a while some much needed new personality. I know we saw Lee May and Serena in uh, Mortal Kombat X, but they were just like, they just showed up in cutscenes. Do you know what I mean? We didn't actually play as these characters. Uh, but Mortal Kombat's done that for a while now. But they didn't, the only time they haven't really done that is with this game, and I'm happy about that. But anyway, we've got. We've reached the end of the credits here, so let's actually see what this is. Let's see what we've got down here. Well, maybe we haven't. <laughs> maybe we haven't reached the end just yet. Come on. NVIDIA, Warner Brothers, there we go. Right, now we've reached the end. No, right, there is no post credit scene. Okay. Well, in that case then, let's actually just have a look at some of the things we've unlocked. I'm going to spend these coins first. There isn't many, but I'm going to spend them anyway. Party Man Kenshi skin and some foregrounds from seasonal currency. I don't know why we got those. Right, collection. Character art. Cyrax, that's cool. That's very cool. Is that it? Yep. Environment art. Night market. Oh, it does, it's, so it is the night market. It's just the different version of it. The maze, Havoc Citadel, Colosseum, or Chaosium, sorry. Is that a giant eye? What the fuck? This is concept art. So maybe the original concept was to have Johnny and Sonya. 
Maybe. Story? Yeah, some stuff here. This is what they slide show through when you watch the credits. They slide for show through this. The pyramid. Right then. And now... Oh wait, we've got music as well. Oh, movies. These are from getting the... Things. If you want to see these, go over to the TikTok. Or just get them yourself. That's that's a better option. Get them yourself. Right, let's start from the start. Let's have a look at what we've unlocked. Anarchy Shadow. Was it not? There we go. Nah. Finishers. Yeah, because I've been playing as them as well. Animality. Fiercely independent, crazed libertarian. <laughs> Gear, yep. Yeah. I prefer that helmet though, I'm gonna be honest. Weapons free, chaos armor. Animality. Right, Takeda. What forgot for Takeda? Oh, chaos. I mean, it's kind of cool. But I prefer this one. And we've got some masks here as well. Yeah, I prefer the one I've got on. Ermac. Ermac's got a new palette. Yeah, so just collective chaos. Katana. Oh, she's got the Maze Hunter skin, look. I'll put that in the favourites, because why not? Because the favourite system actually works somewhat now. Melina. Nah, I prefer the one she's got. Oh, and there you are. She's got her Maze Hunter skin as well. Tanya. Oh, look at that. We've got her Empress skin as well, look. Dragon Caller. Oh, makes sense. Nothing new for Sindel. Something new for Shang Tsung, though. Oh, yeah, because I've got the claws in there. They actually look really cool. Palettes. Chaos. It's very cool, actually. Reiko. Soldier of Turmoil. And then we got Emperor. Emperor Reiko. Cool. Rain, we would have got Emperor Rain, right? That is a cooler stuff, to be fair. Much cooler stuff. I think I'm gonna do that one though, and then do that. Awesome. Awesome. Right, something new for Johnny. Did we get the. Yeah, we did. World War II Johnny. Nice. Nice. Awesome. Love it. Greatest generation. I prefer those sunglasses, the very, um, what's the word? Festival disguise? Chaos. I really like the chaos skins. Some of them are a bit poor. I think that's everything, right? Oh no, we've got something for Quan Chi here. Tribulant Necromancer. Those are just scars, aren't they? And palettes. We've got the Chaos palette. I think Quan Chi's Chaos palette is probably the best one, though. Actually, still remains, still retains some of Quan Chi's personality. But anyway, did we get anything for cameos, I wonder? No, we didn't. Still something for fighters, apparently? 
Oh, Lee May. We got Lee May. And then, yeah, so it will be the Empress skin, won't it? Yeah. Okay. Nothing new for cameos. There is the tutorials, and we think we've got some there. Uh... Oh, what's that? It's a scorpion skin. Story will roar. Havoc, Titan of Anarchy. Uh, so did we get his helmet as well? Yeah, we did. And of course, Chaos Titan. Do that and then randomise. Like how it shows you the what they turn into. That's cool. E. What is what's Liu Kang's one? Oh, he's a phoenix. That's cool. Anyway. Anyway, guys, I don't think there's really much else for me to say here now about all of this. I think it's all really been looked at. Is that Homelander? Is that how that's supposed to be? Yeah, I have played this game a lot, as you can see. It's not just from what I've done as um, story-wise. I do actually play this game sometimes when I can. But anyway, guys, this is going to be where I end this off here. So as always, guys, thank you very much for watching. Take care of yourself, and I'll see you in a bit.